Hey ho everyone, hopefully we can get through this again. This is take three. Um, this is a haul video from scrapbookingmadesimple.com in Santa Clarita, California. She gives free shipping for orders over $50 in most cases. The exceptions are some of the incredible sales that she does. So let's jump into this before I run out. Okay, I ordered these. Now I cannot find an invoice for these. Although I swear I have ordered them before, nor can I find the dies themselves, so I reordered them. This is not a cheap die. I want to say this was a either a twenty dollar or thirty dollar die. I mean, it's this is I want to say it's thirty dollars. It's pretty expensive, but look at all the neat stuff that you get. Um, that's actually a view of the front of a boat with a. A kid and his father. You know, these are great for Father's Day, great for birthdays, great for up here at the resort. So that's what I'm planning on using these for. These along with the micro dots that she started selling this summer. That will make using those very, very easy. So I'll probably do a look what I did video. Okay, and then I picked up some stickers. This was from a different different YouTube. This one is Thinking of You, and I got them in white because I can very easily color these and um, make it different colors for what I need them for. But what I really needed was With Sympathy. Um, we've got several elderly... Uh, not only in the family, but in the church and friends. So we really needed some with sympathy cards. And I, I don't have any stamps that say with sympathy. For some reason, it's one of those things that nobody really wants to make cards for. And then, along with these on that YouTube were these. These are die stamp or die stampers. These are from Hero Arts. Um, let's go through the colors and we'll take a look at the last one. This one is... Da, 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 I think this one is Dolphin. I want to say this one is Dolphin. Yes. And then this one is... is uh, Autumn. Those are some nice colors in Autumn. And then this, I want to say, is Sky. Yep, Sky. Oh, Sky to Indigo. Okay. And then this set is called Serenity Sunset. All right. And let's take a look at the Serenity Sunset. You can see that it has three very distinct ink pads. All right with three very distinct colors. All right, now, the way that you use these, from my understanding is you get a background stamp or whatever stamp you're using, and you go up and down like this, just little bits, okay? That way, where those stamps meet, you're not ending up with this line of nothingness. Otherwise, you will have very distinct lines and a ridge of nothing in between. So you want to go up and down just a little bit, just so those that little area blends. Or you can go up and down quite a bit and blend it out a little bit more. Okay? And, wow, I really got through this quick. So, let's take a look at the thinking of you. As long as I have the time... And my recorder is actually working. <clears throat> the first time I did this, it shut off in the middle of my, my uh, showing you guys the die scent. And then the second time, it only recorded for like 48 seconds, and then it stopped. And it's like, what the heck? Okay, so this is the thinking of you. You can see it. If I can get this light to shine just right. There we go. Thinking of you. Okay. So, what she suggests doing, <clears throat> and I very likely am going to do this for the black ones, because then I can scan them into my brother's scanning cut, 
and make up more or make them bigger or make them smaller. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. All right, now let's see if this will be easier for you guys to see. Nope, not really. That's okay. That's okay. I got other I got other ideas. Ha ha ha. There, this works. Okay, so you can see that it's a very nice very nice uh uh font. Okay. It's not like somebody's handwriting scribble font. It's a very nice, easy to read font. Um, I don't know what note is. Thinking of you note. Okay. But I I do like the thought of urgh, stripping off the background so you can see exactly what you have to work with. And now I can't get this background to go back down, so I'm going to have to tear it off. Really, 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 honestly, truly, this is just toss away. I don't really need that. And it does make it easier to see, but I hate wasting that material. But, um, yeah, so there you go. Okay, so that's it for now, guys. I mean, this was really quick. I was really paranoid that my machine was going to shut off on me again. And, um, yeah. I do have to give you guys a tour up here, don't I, at the resort. Um, we have a pontoon that we rent out. We have... Uh, Canoes, or not canoes, we have kayaks and a canoe, which we will rent. Um, we have, of course, if you rent one of the properties, the kayaks come with, they're not, they don't come with the property, but you get free use of the kayaks. The canoe is still for rent. <laughs> um, we have a paddle well, we sold the paddle boat this year, that's right, because nobody was using the paddle boat, so. Yeah, so, yeah, go to scrapbookingmadesimple.com, and you can, um, you can take and buy this stuff. Uh, everything is still available. She still has these, these are dye-based inks. She does also have some pigment-based inks, but these particular ones are dye-based inks, which means they dry like that. Um, I have them on my fingers from the first time that I tried to show what they were like. And, um, yeah, so what I'm going to end up doing is making some labels to go on the ends that are in the orientation of the stamp pad. So, come on, open up one-handed for me, please. Okay, so that all three colors will be in the proper orientation, and then I can put them on the side, and then I know when I pick them up that putting them this way has these colors, putting them this way has these three colors, and I can just look at them from the side and say, yeah, I want those colors, or yeah, I want those colors, or I want those colors. So, and because they're a distinct orientation, I really do need to do both ends.